Hello everyone, welcome back to Resident Evil. This is obviously a coffee fueled episode, you know that very much. Uh, it's actually not just fueled by coffee this morning. Uh, obviously I had, I had lit coffee. I've got the, uh, the mug right here. Yeah, it's, can I clink it? There we go. <laughs> got the mug right there, but I've also got like, you know, other beverages. So I have myself a protein shake. I have, that's it. That's it really. Let's get on with this, shall we? We're actually quite near to the end. I mean, within the next two episodes, I reckon, I reckon it will be done. It's exciting times, don't you think? Did I ever actually think to get more ammunition out? Hmm. I'll get the handgun out, you know. Probably need another ammo disc. Hell, I'll take both. I don't plan on coming back here anytime, so. Anything else we need that I'm... Just, just trying to plan ahead a little bit, man. Just trying, to, just trying to think, you know, trying to be prepared. I am really exhausted today. I have no idea why I woke up and I'm just like, oh my god, I feel like I haven't slept at all. So excuse me if I'm a little bit, like, not quite as zombie. Not quite as zombie, that's it. If I'm not quite as responsive and, you know, with it today, it's because I'm really not. But I will try my best to, to be MLG, as always. Zombie back off, please. See, this is just exactly what I'm talking about. I am pretty sure I actually pushed the button to use my defensive weapon there, but nothing happened. There, there was no effect. Probably should have... He's actually not dead. Okay. Why did you not grab my feet? Huh. I think this will be the international fail episode because it's going to be a complete demonstration of incompetence. And it's god damn hot today. Oh, dude. Like, dude, you know? I'm trying to remember. We uh, we had to go to this room. Wasn't there? There, was, there was like the slide cartridge and there was, there was some other stuff in here that we, we kind of wanted. But we never got around to getting. And that is a sad situation, my friends. Oh yes, we dropped the zombie in here, I remember that. It was a good, a good couple of days since I've made an episode, you know? Fuel may explode if shaken or jarred. So basically, you know, don't shake or jar it. So it looks like we, all we really needed was that, that slide cartridge. Where do we go now? Well, I'm going to go and use the slide cartridge upstairs. I'm going to triple check if there's any rooms that... No, we've explored all available rooms. Unless there's something that I missed in the lab? Maybe? I don't think so. He's respawned. He's a very, very tall zombie. Maybe it's a scientist thing, because I do bioscience for a degree, and I'm pretty tall. About 6'4". So I'm already maybe a little bit taller than that dude. So that's that computer, isn't it? I don't think I missed anything in here. No, I'm good. There was nothing in the freezer, just a load of frozen crimson heads. Hmm, come on. Oh, wait. We should probably check all the way around, just in case. I know there's more zombies down here, but, you know, I'm going to be fine. Operating table stands neglected. Yep. Genuinely nothing here. Okay. Let's go and use those slide cartridges then, see what's, uh... What's on them? I was trying to think of something a little bit more. I don't know. Words. Words. Words are not my friend today, everybody. Words are not my friend. But I just want to, I'm just doing this like chill, man. I'm so ch just chill doing this right now. Relaxed, content, whatever word you want to use. Whatever adjective is your preference. All right, well, we've got a slideshow here. So umbrella, bioorganic weapon, official report. So these are the dogs. 
Looks like some 3D scan down there. Neptune. That was the shark. Hunter. Oh, God, don't we know about them? The Tyrant. Now, we haven't, you know, encountered that yet, but... Yeah, we'll get there. Bioorganic Weapons Research Group Development Staff. Who's that knobhead wearing sunglasses indoors with blonde gingery hair? Hmm. 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 I don't know. Barcode. Does this have maybe? I think this might have something to do with the code for the thing on the wall. Maybe it's the last four digits. Zero six two three. Let's try that. Shit. There isn't actually a zero, so that's probably not going to be what it is then. Maybe the first four digits? 8341. No, not correct. Hmm. There's got to be something. Hmm. 1706? I don't know. Well, there's no zero, is there? Of course not. Noob. That's what it is. 4444. Very secure. Where do I find the code for this? I mean, legit, you know? What am I missing? Definitely missing something. Hmm. Let me just let me just rack my brain for a second. I genuinely don't know. Three four one seven. Let's try that. I don't know. Nope. Well, one of the documents that we picked up must have something. Just gonna quickly skip through this. Mm. No, it doesn't seem to. Wait a minute. Doesn't actually say anything about this. Is this is the visual data room that we're in right now? But it doesn't seem to say anything. It's a bit of skim reading here. Nope, nothing in there. That's the one about Ada. Unless there's something. I really don't know. Let's have a look at this. This shouldn't really have anything about it. No, that's just about the. Uh, it's just about the patient zero. You know, Crimson Head. Crimson Head Alpha. So where do we go now? In the words of the guns and the roses. Where do we go now? Let's double check the x-ray room. I really, I really don't know where we're meant to be going. Well, of course I know where we're meant to be going. But I'm not explicitly aware of how to get there. Which is quite embarrassing considering I consider myself a veteran of the series. Just not this particular installment. No, there really is nothing in here, is there? Hmm. There's 
no other rooms in this hallway at all, no. The other two doors down this hallway are locked, so I can't get in there. Unless the lock disabled both of them. Come on, lunge. Lunge. Lunge! Bitch, fucking lunge! Oh shit, this is not good. Okay, bait you around this way. There we go. I'm hoping one of the, the electronic lock unlocks one of these doors. No, that's definitely locked. This one probably is as well. Yeah, so they're both still locked. There isn't really anywhere else that we can go. Like, I must be, I must be missing something blindingly simple. Let's check the lab one more time. You guys are probably shouting at the screen like, "You ass! Come on!" You know where it is, you know what you're doing. <sighs> I've checked I've checked all the files. I've tried peeling information from the Is there anything on this computer? I highly doubt it. Let's try again. This is purely for unlocking things. Yeah. Hmm. What am I missing, for God's sake? Ooh, electron microscope. Yes, please. Wouldn't mind one of those in our uni labs, just saying. What the actual balls am I missing? For reals. I need to know that code. How do I know that code? There is nothing here. Those vents look like they pop off. <laughs> that could be interesting. What am I missing? How to get code for thing. So one more look in this room here. That's the only room that I haven't explored. The, one, the door at the end of this hallway is locked by three locks. That's how we save Chris. So there's nothing else in here at all, really? Oh, man. I might have to look this up, you know? Alright, let's, uh, let's do a... Let's do a Google Voice search. Resident Evil Visual Data Room Code. All right, let's see what uh, let's see what the Googles have for us. Right. Bear with me. Okay. In the remake, the player can find various items. The first aid spray is placed on the table, a map by the checking shelf, and a key for the power area in the small room, which requires four passcodes. Four passcodes. <sighs> okay, apparently I need a slide filter. Where the hell do I get a slide filter from? I know I'm missing something now. Okay, let's try this again. Resident Evil slide filter.
This is the best episode, isn't it? Yes. Oh. Uh, this is really not helpful. Location. It is found in the, lab in the laboratory. No shit, it's found in the laboratory. No. I don't believe that for a second. <laughs> uh, I just... Bloody hell. <laughs> Apparently it is down here. It's apparently it's on the desk underneath the X-ray board. I'm not so sure it is, mate. I've checked that room about seven times. So I'm kind of calling bullshit. Okay, can we see a slide filter? There is really nothing here. Do I have to have this, this light on to be able to see it? Genuinely, there is no, there is no slide filter in here. There really is not. I am so confused. Is my game like bugged or something? This is bullshit, I'm just saying. I swear to god, there is nothing in here. Alright, I'm just gonna bring up a, a little map. It says it's a. Uh, I just wanna check we've actually got the right room. I mean, it looks like it. X-ray room B. I mean, maybe this is X-ray room A. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. This is absurdity. It's taking the bloody piss, if you ask me. First time I've got a little bit annoyed at a Resident Evil game just because incompetence. Slide filter. Slide filter. Slide filter. Yes, I get it. There is no slide filter. There is... You know, fuck it. I'm just going to go... I know I know it's from that... Um, I know it's from the passcode thing somewhere. You know, the barcode at the end of the slide. I know that... The code is something from that barcode. So I'm just going to go and guess some numbers. I'm really irritated, man. Oh, fuck. This is bad. Ha, <laughs> wrecked. Probably should have taken care of that, shouldn't I? Okay. Alright, let's pick some random numbers. Um, let's do all the old ones. Let's just do like... I don't bloody know. Eight, six, five. Oh, fuck, that's not... That's not an even number. Hey, let's just... Whatever. That'll do. Yeah, no. Sod it, I'm looking it up. I don't even care. Don't care. Not... Not even... Don't even care. 
Where is this code? Where is it? Here we go. It is actually the num uh, even numbers. How funny is that? Oh, man. I'm really irritated by that. That really just grated on my nerves. Oh, no, you give me the bloody power key. Some sort of image editing equipment. It looks like you can use it to view Kenneth's film. View the film? Obviously. It's not a very good shot, is he? I don't deserve to die. Yeah. Heartless, man. Heartless. Alright, so I got the power key. Bloody finally. Ugh. I'm wrapping this episode up, man. I need to go de-stress. Do some freaking like, I don't know, yoga or something. <sighs> Thanks for putting up with me. You, you, you people. Wait a minute. Shake that board, dear. Alright, I'm done. <laughs> it's driven me crazy. Thanks for watching, guys. I, uh, we'll see you in the next one, yeah? Which will be on the way soon. Yes. Videos! Woo! Resident Evil's bugged! You'll do a little bit of research to see if this has happened to anyone else. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye.